everyone, welcome back to the Scottish Cowboys Darts channel. As you've probably just watched the recent unicorn launch, some smashing darts in this launch, it's going to be a cracking launch for unicorn. I thought I would grab a set of the unicorn Ross Smiths from St Helens Dart Shop. Now these are going to retail about £65. I'll put details on at the end of the video how to get these from St Helens Dart Shop. These are highly anticipated darts. Everybody's been seeing them for the past few weeks, months even, and been wanting to know when they're coming out. So they're finally out. They are called the Ross Smith Two-Tone Darts. So these ones are 24 grams. So we'll do the normal. We'll get them over the table. We'll get them to the board. And we'll come back here, give it a recap, and give them the ratings. So let's crack on. <laughs> First look at the Ross Smith box, just comes in a nice standard unicorn box. You've got the Ross Smith with the Ross Smith logo, telling you on here it's 100 micron ultra fly flights, gripper shafts and tungsten barrels. On the back you've got a picture of Ross Smith, or well, three pictures of Ross. You've got his little logo again in the back. You've got a little thing on the back of the box telling you, unless otherwise stated, the weight indicated is the approximate average weight of one pointed dart body. Soft tip, one complete dart. And is for guidance and comparison only. Also a little warning telling you darts is an adult sport. So quite a nice looking, looking box. Nice clear window in it. With Rossi's darts. So let's get them opened and have a look at them. So as I said, these are going to retail about £65 from St Helens Dart Shop. They're 90% tungsten. So I believe, but that's got, it's not got that row on the box at all. But I do believe they're 90% tungsten. I will check that and put it in the video for you. Comes in very cheap looking packaging, if I'm going to be honest. That may be keep costs down, but... I don't know, Unicorn's packaging is usually really good. So we'll take one out, put the other two to the side. So there you go. Now, everybody's been seeing these on the TV for the past months when Ross signed with Unicorn. When he signed with Unicorn, he was using his old darts for a few tournaments. And then he got these. And everybody was wanting to know when they were coming out. And I've got to say, they look absolutely magnificent. You can t see why they're called two-tone, because you've got the gold and the black. That's a really nice looking dart. So let's start at the front. Comes fitted with the volute point, as you can see. We're going to measure that and see what length the point is. I'm estimating 26 mil, But we'll check it just in case. Oops, I missed it. There you go, it is actually 29.6, so it's actually a 30 mil point that's in this dart. So if you like a long point, 30 mil, you've got a wee added bonus here. At the front of the barrel you'll see it's a, a bull nose or a ball nose. It's what some people call it bull, some people call it ball. And all it is is straight cut grooves. Small one, then a large one, and it's large ones all the way up. The first quarter of the barrel is the gold bit of the barrel. Then you've got that section where all the manufacturers now have this, where they put their laser etching logo on it. You've got Unicorn, and you've got Ross Smith's logo, which is actually really well done. So you've got that flat band, but I'm a front gripper, and that's not going to affect me. That's still going to be okay. Middle grippers, you're maybe going to get... Cut out a little bit, but you still get good grip. Then on the last two thirds of the dart, you've got the second tone, which is a black, and it's just straight cut grooves again. But they're quite a good cut in them. I'm going to say straight away they're going to be. This is going to be about a two, two and a half grip. I don't think it's going to be any better than that. And then you come up to the unicorn gripper shaft. Which will take this fight out and out and give this shaft a measure. Just so people can know what the full size of the dart is. 
So that's 40.76, so that's probably, it's not going to be a medium, it's going to be an intermediate stem I think, it's not short, that's for sure, but that's coming from the size, it's coming from the thread shoulder to the top and it's 40.77. So let's get a little measure of the barrel because I've got no sizes for this yet the barrel length I'm thinking about 50 48.2 so it's a 48.2 long 48.3 and a diameter oh don't like that 666 6.62 6.65 6.66 6.65 I'm thinking that's going that's meant to be 6.65 so I'm saying 6.65 by 48.3 so it's a decent size that it's not too long it's not too short put the stem back on get a good look at this flight the flight's really really nice as well can have flight, that's really really nice, tells you on the box what flight it is, it's a 100 micron ultra fly and that is a number 6 so what we'll do next is we've had a look at them, we've done the measurements we'll get them onto the scales do a super close up with them and then do what I really want to do, get them onto the board because I really like the look of this. This is going to be a popular dart. Definitely. So let's get them over to the scales. So we've got the scales ready. Let's get the darts on. Get them weighed. First dart. 24.13. Second dart, 24.06 and the third dart, 24.00. So from one dart to another there is 0 0.13 of a difference which is, it's out more than I would expect from a unicorn but these things happen, they get through like that. I would... I preferred them to be within 0 0.05 going up or down but they're just slightly out for that but we'll see how we got on with the throwing section full setup 25.67 so I've got the Ross Smiths in my hand ready to throw and straight off the bat I'm going to tell you the grip's about a two and a half. It's, it's, I don't know if it's going to be any higher but we'll work that out as we go through the throne. That little band that's got Ross Smith's logo on it. My thumb is on it quite a bit but I don't know if it would going to affect me. Let's have a few throws and see. So we'll do about 15 darts then we'll do a two one challenge. So here goes. Oh, last start was rubbish. Coming out my hand really good, going through the air really good. And the landing and the board are quite a big angle for me. Oh, deflection. As you can see, they're kicking to the left, but that's down to the number six flight. It just happens with me. If I put a number two on this, they would go in straight. And the flight goes, but a cheeky wee 140. They definitely come out of your hands so easy and so nice. 
these are going to be really popular. If you like a straight barrel, you like a dart that's not too long, these might be a dart for you. The stem that comes with it is probably too long for me. But I like that. So I'll have another two throws, then we'll get the two one challenge done. Nice little turn as my dogs introduce themselves to my YouTube channel. So let's get a 2 on 1 challenge done. Kevin to throw first. Game on. One hundred. Kevin, you require one hundred and one. Forty-three, Kevin. You require fifty. Get in here. Yes, game shot and the match, Kevin. recap on the Ross Smith two-tone unicorn darts just launched today as you can see from the throne section the more I threw with them the better I got with them I really like throwing them I'm getting quite fond of a straight barrel at the moment as you've probably seen from my previous reviews but the grip on these is really good it's a two and a half at the front it's a two in the middle and it's a two and a half at the rear it just you when you when you let the dart go it just comes out so easy there's no interference because of the grip it's brilliant on value for money for these darts now these are retailing around about 65 pounds you can get them from st helen's dart shop i'll put the phone number on the screen i'll put the address on the screen just get in touch with them they'll get them sent out to you next day You'll be a happy chap at getting your darts. But at £65, I expect better than this, to be honest. It's one of my bugbears, is when you get a dart that's at that price, £65, and it comes in the plastic like that. Now, I've done lots of Unicorn darts, Premier, Noir, and they come in the nicest packaging ever. The Michael Smith World Champion ones come in nice and packaging. These are £65. And not much difference in the, that at the price. I would expect better packaging. I would expect it for, to have that kind of packaging in a dart. I would expect it to be well under £50. Just my opinion. So it's an 8 out of 10 for value for money because the dart is fantastic. This dart could have been a 10 out of 10. But the packaging lets it down. Nobody throws the packaging, we know that. But you get lots of collectors out there and that's 
It's ju just my opinion. I'm quite a stickler on packaging. Overall, 8 out of 10. Fantastic dart. Taking away the packaging, everything else, just based on the darts, 8 out of 10. It is brilliant. I loved it. Would I swap from my Gabriel Clemens Gen 2s? No. Would I use them again? <laughs> They're not going back in the box, as you can see. So I'm going to be using them for a little while tonight. I'm going to change to a number two flight, put a shorter stem in because when I was throwing them and I was pulling them back, they were a bit long, they were hitting me in the, in the shoulder. So I'm going to have another throw with these tonight. As I said, hit up St Helen's Dart Shop, they've got the full new Unicorn range in there plus every other brand under the sun. Hit that subscribe button, please. Hit the thumbs up if you like the video. Hit the notification bell so you know when the next videos are coming because I'm getting close to the subscriber point when I'm doing the next giveaway and you don't want to miss that because you never know, it might be these darts. It might be an RCA darts. Most importantly, keep enjoying your darts and I'll catch you in the next review.